Jacob and his people are resilient. I'll give them that. Trinity is on their way. They could do with my help. And this atlas from the mural. If it really is some kind of map of the ruins, I've got to find it before Anna. If I don't, then all these deaths will have been in vain. And I can't have that on my conscience. This vase must have been beautiful once, but someone's poked a few new holes in it and filled it with dirt. They must have used it to grow seedlings. We can make points faster than broadheads. That should be our focus. Another difficult winter for my people. There are more deaths and births now. And as the seasons pass, the young ones are becoming restless. I see them looking to the sky when the rare plain passes overhead. Wistful. Wondering. Longing. I know they are still deeply committed to the cause. But I also sense a change coming. An end to our way of life is on the horizon. The most recent invaders are fading from memory. But as the technology of men advances, more are bound to find our valley again. And we are bound with the fate of this place. For better, or worse. You're Jacob's guest. If you're looking for a way to help, they're repairing the guard towers just down the path. I mean no offense, but you don't look like you're ready for a turn on the anvil. Ella. Did you bring anything to trade? 
anything we could use. Not much fuel left in the torch. I think I can get four, maybe five more sheets cut for the barricades. And then we'll have to find more. That's gonna be a problem. I dragged the last of those cylinders out of the Soviet prison a few summers back. After that, you're back to using a hammer and chisel. There's gotta be more. The Soviets left everything behind. We spent two full days combing the old buildings. That's the last of them. Don't worry, you like the chisel. It never runs dry. Historic carving of the bear. The stone looks like it could have come from this valley. coming. One that threatens to lead to more mistakes. I spent time alone with Alia. Something I have avoided until now. She reminds me of my beloved Sophia. Whom I thought I'd long forgotten. And it opens my heart like a wound. She clouds my judgment. Even when she is not present. <sighs> I sound like a giddy child. And those days are far behind me. I must bury these old feelings deep and stay apart from my people for a time. I'll run out of mail before we're done here. We can pull more out of the old cabins. The ones we don't use anymore. Can't this make four more? I just need a few dozen. You there. We could use some help if that's what you're here for. I'm here to help. What can I do? We're trying to fortify as many of these towers as we can. Most of them were badly damaged in last year's floods. We've got the repairs in hand, but I need some extra supplies from around the valley. If we can get these towers repaired, it'll give us an advantage over the invaders. And it'll help us reach the upper levels of the ruined towers. Will you help? There's not enough. We have to make do. There has to be more. Send someone to go look. Send who, exactly? Everyone's heading down to the lower village to prepare. How did you I'm telling you, you have to improvise for now. What brought you here? He's making arrowheads. As many as he can before they arrive.
sorry. I've got no time to talk. Jacob says you can be trusted. That's good enough for me. Young ones, you scoffed at learning your letters, said it had nothing to do with hunting, but that's your first lesson. Everything is connected, and I am always right. You clever students who saw the folly and stubbornness and can read this, here's your first assignment. Track, hunt, and bring me back the pelt of one of the small creatures of the valley. Hairs you can find anywhere, night or day, both the little brown ones in our valley and the snow hairs in the peaks. The squirrels stick to the trees and rain will drive them into their burrows. And if you see fit to seek the rats, look inside the ruins or anywhere the dead still lie. Please, do not bring me a rat. Here is your lesson for today. Bring me any creature with feathers. The birds in our valley fly mostly by day, nesting away at dark. You've seen gulls and other kinds farther afield. Those common birds would count for today's lesson, but it would lack ambition. You clever students who wish to impress me would do well to head to the high elevations between dawn and dusk. I would find Buzzard most impressive. And before you ask, the chickens around our village came here with our ancestors. Bringing me a tame bird from your mother's yard will not fulfill the assignment. Followers of the Prophet fled to the east. The 
journey was difficult. 